I bet I would All alone, what's up with you ho? Bitch, you smoking drunk, bitch, you know Bust like 44 when I spit that flow Cause we go Yo, what is happening, little lizards? It's your boy, Lemon Art Fairy Patrick, back at it again Bringing you a tutorial on how to get over your fear of roller coasters. So, my name is Lemon Up There again, as I've already stated. And I would like to thank you guys so much for 180 subscribers. Um, when I hit 200, I will have a new, um, what's it called? A new merchandise out for you guys to buy. So, if you guys are interested, go check that out. But that's not the reason. So, let's get right into the tutorial. So, first of all, like, roller coasters are safe. When you're afraid of roller coasters, don't be, because they're safe. One thing that used to always frighten me about roller coasters would be that the fact that my lap bar or would come up when I was riding and it wouldn't and I would fall out. So trust me, they won't. They're perfectly secure and you should be all right as you're riding it. Um, th now another thing that happens, the the reason why accidents happen is because of the rider's stupidity. Riders who are stupid when they st like stand up during a ride. Or they like put out a selfie stick. Yeah, I mean, accidents will happen because they either like put the selfie stick up against the rail or the track, or th they're gonna hit somebody or something. Or if they stand up during the ride, perhaps the the lap bar may come up or the seatbelt might came undone. So you don't want to be stupid when riding roller coasters. And now, so the thing is, when you ride roller coasters that I've learned over the time is to have fun. Don't do don't do stupid things. And, like, just go, like, go with your friends. Like, don't go by yourself if you're afraid of roller coasters. Go with friends that surround you, that are your, like, really good, like, really good, how's the way to put this? They're, they're really good with, like, helping people. That's the word. And also, just one thing that helps you, because if you, like, are prone to motion sickness or whatever, like, if you have motion sickness problems, my, my theory is this. When you go to the bathroom, like, after you eat or, like, before you go to the amusement park, trust me, like, it feels like you've got everything out of your system, and it makes you feel a lot less, um, it makes you feel a lot less lighter. So making that mean that whatever you ate, like, say you ate a double-double from In-N-Out, like, say, and then you just went to the bathroom and got that, and got it out, then you don't have to worry too much about motion sickness. So, and that's what I've learned over the time, so... Here's what we got so far. Hang out with, go with your friends. Um, go to the bathroom before going on any rides. Um, what's it called? The lap bar is perfectly safe. You don't have to worry about that. It's perfectly secure. And then you don't have to worry about accidents because that comes from stupidity. So now the next tip I have is when you're riding roller coasters and they have really big drops or loops or corkscrews and you don't like them, do this. Close your eyes. Close your eyes, cause then you feel like, then you can't see the drop, and you can't see nothing. Like that helps me out so much. If, if, cause believe me, I was afraid of roller coasters. I mean, I'm afraid of drops even still. But like the thing is, like when you close your eyes, you don't see the drop, so you don't have to worry about it. Like yeah, you can hang on. You still have to hang on, otherwise it's gonna feel you're gonna feel heavy or light. But like the thing is, with when you're riding roller coasters, don't worry about like drops. That's just the adrenaline. Like you're getting adrenaline from that. So and that's the whole point of it. So now the next part is the next step is don't worry about what others are thinking. Like if they think the ride is terrifying or the ride is like um scary or like whatever in their opinion, like do try it for yourself. Like don't do what other people don't follow what other people say. Like, say your friend doesn't want to go on it. Show them my tips or anybody else's tips to help them get over this. Like, obviously, I mean, you've came to the right place if you're afraid of roller coasters. I mean, I've been around roller coasters since I was, like, four. And some people haven't even rode in roller coasters since, like, when, until the, like till now. Since you watched this video and you're going to an amusement park tomorrow. Like, and you're 30 years old. Have you ridden a roller coaster since? Like, since you were born? Maybe you've ridden one. But you didn't like it. So, cause you didn't know these tips on how to get better and how to understand what a roller coaster is about. A roller coaster is about fun. It's an excitement. You don't go to an amusement park to, uh, like ride, like to play in an arcade, to ride, like a kiddie ride, or ride, like the Dumbo, um, plane thing at Disneyland, or like Buzz Lightyear, what, like whatever the, it may be. You go to an amusement park for the amusement and the excitement. And to ride stuff. 
Now, some of you, that may not be your case. You obviously go to hang out with friends. That, uh, yeah. I know a lot about that, too. I, do, I hang out with my friends at amusement parks all the time. So all you got to do is follow these steps, and you, may, and you may just find yourself a roller coaster expert. So now the next thing is when you ride roller coasters is, like, if they have, when you're waiting in line, don't panic. Don't, like, don't listen to what other people are saying. Like, say that, oh, like, they're trying to scare you, obviously. So don't worry about it. Like, if you're young, like me, then don't listen to what other people say. If you're older, then, yeah, that's okay. But, like, say you got, because it's about grad night time for high school. So if you guys are watching this from, like, getting ready for grad night, please, like, follow these steps. It'll help you out so much in the long run. So, and now the last step I have is to have fun. If, when, if you're, like, if you're not having fun, then why are you there? Like, you're there to have fun. You're not there to not have fun. That's the whole point of an amusement park. Like, you're there to, like, see the mascots as well, but you're there to ride. That's the whole point. Like, if you're not riding roller coasters, then why are you there? Stay home. Like, there's no point of going if you don't, if you're afraid of roller coasters. So just remember, if you're afraid of drops or loops or corkscrews, just close your eyes and, and you'll feel nothing. And if you have motion sickness, don't focus, like, go to the bathroom and let it all out and then go on the ride. And then when you, and then if you're not, if you're afraid to go on by yourself, get, grab a couple friends and then, oh, oh, oh. And also it'll help you out so much. But yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. If you guys want to see more of this, remember to claw that like button. And again, I'm Lemon Raptor and I hope you see you guys again. Bye.